So I've been animating some captions for the last few months. I just wanted to take you through it. It's not that difficult actually, it's just text animators. It starts off with me bringing in some footage, auto captioning it with the text panel, and then my captions get all made. Then I start refining and making sure that phrases are together and not broken apart multiple captions. In each caption, the word count is balanced across the top and bottom and just getting the timing right. Once that's done, I then take it into After Effects. Something to remember, you can't import captions into After Effects directly. You have to upgrade the captions first into a graphic, otherwise it just, it just won't go. I've got a text preset and this is based off the slide and pop in. I have just changed it so that instead of coming in on the Y axis, it comes in on the X axis. So I've saved that as my own preset and then I just apply that preset to every caption after doing the painful process of taking all the individual captions out of its own pre-comp and then into the main comp, copying manually every single pre-comp. I don't even know why it gets imported like that in the first place. All right, so I did another Google search and this is what I found, unpre-compose. This does exactly what we needed to do. So you can just do layer unpre-compose Pose. It just brings it all back, deletes the pre-comps all in one step. Beautiful. This is a big time saver. And then you just drag out the keyframes so that the words come on as they are being said. So it looks like you've timed every word perfectly. And then after that, you have to highlight the words. So I've got this script that I use called Smart Rect. That allows you to make a rectangle where you have different properties for the width and scale. So you've got the width and the X scale. But the X scale is always animating from 0 to 100%. So once that's dialed in and eased, just place it where I want, set the width, and then move on to the next one. But that's it really. There's no software. It's all done manually pretty effective. You get a lot of freedom and flexibility with it. So in the last intro, you see how I'm getting a bit more creative with it, with like shakes and those are just wiggle expressions and rotations and all this kind of stuff. So yeah.